Our next guests are veteran actresses from hit shows like The Hughleys and Girlfriends. And now they're starring in a hot new reality show. I know. Here with the inside <laughs> scoop on Hollywood Divas or Golden Brooks and Elise Neal. Ladies, hey, hey, welcome. welcome to the show. Thanks, Thanks for having us. You both look beautiful. You. Better in person. Thank you. Yeah. That's a sideways compliment. You know that. No, no, no. You know what? I hear that all the time, and now I've just learned to just roll with it. Yeah, your I'll tins on TV, store. 11's in person. See? Oh, well, okay. thank you. Good save. Good save. Good save. Good save. <laughs> he got out of that grave yeah. really quickly, didn't he? Exactly. <laughs> so let's talk about reality television. We all know you from the small screen on hit shows, mm -hmm. like Shannon mentioned mm -hmm. earlier, but why reality television? Well, this show is completely different, and that's why both of us decided to sign on. You know, this is a show about women that, like you said, you know us from the shows that you guys love. Mm -hmm. You know us from everything we do in our in our professional lives. Right. This was a chance for you, us to get you to see what we really are about. Right. Okay. And you know, you just don't know us. You know the characters that we play. That's true. And that has been such a journey and just a life opening experience for me. I feel that yeah. Golden feels the same way. I mean, I, I have been so blessed to have been on a show for, for you know almost a decade doing Girlfriends and it was so amazing and such a godsend. And it was in, you know, that show was such a traditional form in terms of what we do as actors. And I thought, how interesting would it be to kind of break outside of that yeah. and get into something that would show my fans, show the audiences, who Golden Brooks is. Golden Brooks, the writer. Golden Brooks, the mother. Golden Brooks, the girl who likes to be silly and, and goofy, who likes to swim, who, you know, there's so many facets to who we are. And, you know, the business is changing. And mm -hmm. it's, 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 it's interesting to use a medium like reality to sort of platform and springboard all of the other things that are really, really true to who we are. Absolutely. Yeah. So what's going to make this show different from all the other reality shows out? What I think one of the best things about this show is the fact that you have five strong African-American women of different sizes, types, and everything else coming together to do a project on this actual Hollywood Divas reality show. We create our own project mm -hmm. on the show, right. yeah, which is so positive that. and so amazing. I can't give you every we can't detail give you about everything. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, let's talk about the other cast members. Right. Sure. Okay, yeah. so there's Countess Vaughn from Moesha, Lisa yeah. Wu from Real Housewives of yeah. Atlanta, Paula Jai Parker from True Blood, mm -hmm. and Friday. So what's the chemistry like for you all on set? Is it slumber party, cat fight? Yeah. Who's the biggest yeah. diva? You know, Dish. we all, first of all, I have to say, we respect each and every one Everybody. of these girls. All, I mean, I respect Elise. We respect each other. You know, we all come from different walks of life, mm -hmm. but we just respect each and every girl for what they bring to the table. And, you know, it's already... It already is a struggle or a hurdle, you know, out there in the world, in mm -hmm. Hollywood. And when we come together, we're creating something that's that's positive, that's empowering. And so when you're creating something that's positive and empowering, you want to respect the group that you're with. And Absolutely. that's pretty much what we're doing. Okay, right. that sounds great. Who's yes. the biggest diva? Ah! To the dirt. Come on. You're like, give me that. So, you know, she's powerful. Being, powerful. Listen, she's being Come very, on. very truthful because the bottom line is that's why we were on the show is yeah. to create mm -hmm. something. It wasn't about being extra. But you won't tell us what it is. Okay, but the, the, a, okay, well, that, you can't tell, tell you what the film is. We can't that tell you what the album is. Right. No. no, it's a television project. Oh, okay. television project. Okay. It's a television project. You know, that's all I can tell you. I can't show you. I can't tell you. Oh, well, let's look at some of that drama. We have a clip real quick. And then we'll discuss. Well, then there you go. Tell you everything you need to know. Yes, clip. Yes. <laughs> How, How are you? you? See you in forever. Such What's nice. going on? Yes. So Eating. now, are we feeling a little more secure in the game? Yes. yes. I see Golden Brooks, so I'm like, whoo. Okay. We can probably make this work. Golden's good. All right. And I see Countess. I'm like, okay, different energy, you know, but a great actor. So, okay, we're good. We got two. We got three. We got three people. Girl, at least like a year ago. Or it wasn't at that party. No, the Grammy party. Give me a line. Maybe. No. I, no. Oh, no. No. The, the yes. Oscar party. The Oscar party. Oscar party. No, it was great. Was it? Maybe it was That's, Oscar. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. Oscar yeah. Night party. Yes. That was it. Now I've known Elise for more than 15 years, but the minute she sees Golden, it's all he he kiki and ha ha. They best friends. 
Uh oh. Uh, Are you telling me there's already clips okay. performing on this show? <laughs> I didn't that see that. Hilarious. That was funny. Oh, I've never seen that either. Oh, I didn't see but, that yet. But I'll say this. That's funny. That I, think that's, I mean, that's what it's supposed yeah. to be to draw. That's the clip you your in. people sent us. Yeah. So. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm Listen, fine with the clip. I, we're seeing a lot of things, you know. But, but it's, it's honestly, good. I'm fine with the clip because so the bottom what is that line like, is, though, seeing yourselves on reality television and seeing clips like this because you don't really know what they're going to do with everything you that you film. And that is the part of this medium that you just don't know. Mm -hmm. I mean, honestly, you just... I just decided that I know what I'm going to say, mm -hmm. and if they use something that I, you know, they're going to use what you put out. Right. And I was just very careful with what I put out. But I'm not mad at that clip. I'm not mad at her. I'm not, I'm I'm not mad at her. Grown, I'm grown. Golden, I feel like what do you think? Fine. Because yeah, when you're dealing with a script, you know exactly what's coming. Mm -hmm. You right. deliver your lines, scene. But in reality television, yeah. they tape and tape, tape, tape for hours, and we then did. they decide what they want to use. It's true. You know, when you're acting, you can hide behind a character. You know, mm -hmm. there's something, there's a script. It's everything's written for you. All you do is make those creative choices. Um, it, you know, I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty. I'm stripped down. You know, it is. It is a little. It's frightening because you don't know what's going to happen. I'm not in the editing room, but like I said, I know all I can do is be accountable to myself, yeah, be accountable absolutely. to what comes out of my mouth. How they edit it, I can't do anything about that. So I just, you know, keep my fingers crossed and go with God. I know I'm accountable to me and mm -hmm. what comes out of my mouth. Absolutely. And that's all I can do at the end of the day. I can sleep at night. Okay, then <laughs> on the scale of one to ten, how much drama is going to be in this show? Because it has divas in the title, so. Yes. Well, first of all, we don't like the, no, the negative don't. connotation to a diva. A diva oh, okay. is like Dorothy Dandris in my eyes and her Diana eyes. Ross. A diva oh, is gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Diana Ross. A diva is, you know, an Lena opera Horn. singer. An opera you know what I'm saying? Singer, exactly. okay. And it used to not have a, a negative connotation, mm -hmm. the word diva. I think we've turned it and made it something negative. I don't think that means that at all. I want us, everyone, to see that we women, even though we fight because we were passionate mm -hmm. about our project, right. that's mm -hmm. where the fights come in. Right. Passionate about like the passionate. about the project. Uh -huh. okay. That's where the arguments start. <laughs> right. Uh -huh. And then we became something beautiful, and we created a great show because of it. Speaking mm -hmm. of great shows, Golden, we have mm -hmm. to talk about Girlfriends. Okay. Now, in the past <laughs> few weeks, there's been a lot of buzz about a possible movie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is it going to happen? Please say that it is. Oh, Fingers gosh. Crossed. I, you know, I wish I could say it so. I, you know, it honestly is a Mara Brock Akil question and okay. a Kelsey Grammer question and a Paramount question. You know, but however, Mara, myself, Jill, Tracy, uh, Persia, Reggie, the fifth girlfriend, mm -hmm. <laughs> we all met and talked about the idea of, really? of a movie. And yeah, but I mean, everyone's schedules are all over the place. Tracy now doing Blackish, Mara, you know, doing Mary Jane. I think once we all, now I'm doing, you know, Hollywood Divas, I think once we come together and figure it all out, I know the fans want that. We do. There yes. are talks <laughs> of it, so I'm hoping, fingers crossed, we just have to see how all the cards lay so out. So if Mara right. calls you up and says it's happening, are you in? Well, absolutely. Okay. We've already met for it. So oh. we already had a yeah. little discussion. Okay. But do, I'm not the writer. Okay. Don't kill we'll the messenger. Online campaign. Don't worry. It's <laughs> going on. It okay. is going on. Yeah. yeah. I'm just, you know, I would be game. I love, you know, I love Mara. I love the girls. I love Reggie. Mm. It was just such a great franchise. And if they want to continue on with it, I'm, I'm game. Okay. Oh, At God. least anything yes. in your future we should know oh, about? Oh, no, absolutely. I'm in part of the uh, Leah biopic on Lifetime. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, I'm playing the amazing Gladys Knight in that. Oh, yes. I have a great thing called Friday Night, uh, Fright Night Files for Halloween for TV One as well. Mm -hmm. oh, but I'm yeah, playing a, a character, Coffee Black. So, you know, I'm, I'm always Ooh, working. Done. I'm always doing stuff. Yeah, and you I'm just very you proud and happy. I just did a holiday movie for TV One myself called uh, Second Chance for Christmas. So please yeah. check that out, yeah, which we'll, is great. We'll definitely check out all those projects. <laughs> and we'll you. check out the premiere of Hollywood Divas on Wednesday night, 10 p.m. TV One. Boom. Thank all right. You. You got it. Thank, Thank you so you. much for being here. Thank you. Boom. <laughs> and you're watching Arise Entertainment 360. Boom.